Hey guys, uh, David Barkos here from BNB Products. Uh, today I'm here to talk about the ever-growing concern of the uh, COVID-19 coronavirus. It's currently out in uh, Australia and globally. Um, the moment that this became a pandemic, uh, I just started making phone calls straight away to uh, any connections that I had um, that could help me come up with some sort of a uh, steriliser or, or protectant because uh, I knew this was going to be a problem uh, not only for my own customers um, but for all my uh, all my dealer connections and stuff like that I knew straight away this was going to become a problem so uh, you know we've got something here we've we've brought to market as, as soon as possible it took uh, I can't even explain how many late nights and, and hours um, and lots of resources lots of manpower um, but I'm here today to uh, show COVID Combat, which is a steriliser and uh, disinfectant um, specifically formulated for the automotive industry for cars. Um, what I found straight from the bat was, okay, I need to sterilise a car, what am I going to do? Um, I tried using disinfectant wipes, uh, we tried using all types of different chemicals and we found lots of uh, negative results, um, mainly due to plastics going white, um, discoloration, stains, um, and all of these I found were just not adequate for automotive use. Um, so I worked with probably about two or three different people um, and one, one chemist to sort of get this concoction going. Um, it works great, doesn't leave any stains, doesn't have any sort of uh, reactions to, to the plastics, to leathers, to vinyls. Um, and it also has an 80% alcohol rating, which is uh, quite a bit uh, stronger than what's available domestically at the moment or uh, anywhere else in the market. Uh, it is in very, very short supply. Um, we are currently got a pallet coming from Queensland. I've got another pallet coming from New South Wales. Um, you know, it's fantastic how people want to sort of profit off this because I'm paying you know, tenfold what I normally would for, for some of these chemicals. But, um, you know, we're doing whatever we have to uh, to ensure that we can uh, give peace of mind uh, to our clients, to the consumers. Um, if we don't put peace of mind to the consumers, it's, it's going gonna, it's gonna to do a lot of damage to the entire automotive industry. We're, we're looking to launch uh, as of next week. Um, we've got the first 500 litres. Um, and we've got probably about another thousand litres uh, on its way. Um, but in terms of how long for, I don't know. Uh, we, we'll, we're doing the best we can. Um, we'll just have to roll it out. Yeah. So COVID Combat was a design in mind for pocket use. So, you know, PD staff, sales staff, um, you know, service staff can keep something on hand with them. Um, and it was also something that can be put in the cup holder of the consumer's car. Um, so they feel, you know, reassured that, you know, this has been taken care of, sterilised and disinfected. Um, you know, it, it is quite worrying with the coronavirus having somewhere around over 500 cases in Australia at the moment. Um, and, you know, anyone that knows simple math uh, can do the numbers and it is something that is... Uh, you know, it is of great concern and uh, there's nothing out there in the automotive market as of yet um, to protect uh, vehicles or sanitise vehicles, disinfect vehicles. So uh, that's what COVID combat's for. Um, you know, everyone's out sort of trying to make their own hand sanitizers and, and all this other stuff for, uh, you know, human use. Um, but there is quite a, a few different elements that, that are required to, to achieve that. and. You know, sometimes you can get a few of the products and you can't get the other, so you're never really fixing the situation, whether, you know, the COVID combat being 80% alcohol, um, you know, really is quite, quite strong. Um, you know, the idea is that you spray it on these plastics and the leathers and all this uh, high traffic areas, steering wheels, gear shifters, uh, door handles inside and outside and seating areas. Um, wait for it to, uh, to dry and wipe down. Um, and then it's, it's safe for use. So, um, you know, if we don't make a, uh, an active um, decision now, then uh, I think it's gonna affect car sales nationally 
for the next six to eight months, if not longer. Um, so I think we should give a COVID combat a go. Um, if you need anything, you can contact me via uh, my email address, which is david.bbproducts at gmail.com uh, for appointments. Uh, and I can come down, talk about the product. Uh, happy to do a live demonstration um, and we can take orders. So yeah, thank you very much.